So, of course, we'll discuss that and a lot more, Rima. But for now, we'll start with the auto sector. The industry delivered a mixed bag of sales for the month of October and market leader Maruti Suzuki particularly saw sales dip 5% over the previous month. Our colleague Sonia Shanoi caught up with Shashank Srivastava, who is the senior ED, marketing and sales at the company, and started by asking about the outlook for sales over the next few months. I think uh, with the semiconductor situation getting better, the production getting better, uh, and the pending bookings in the industry uh, still quite strong, I would expect uh, November and December numbers to be also strong. Although I must say that towards the year end, uh, we would uh, like ideally the inventory levels, both at the dealership and the factory to be at uh, the minimum. So um, uh, we'll get to know, uh, we'll, we'll see the, uh, the, the way the inflow of bookings happen to make the judgment for the future months. Uh, by the way, October retails were in the industry estimated to be 368,000 against uh, the, uh, the, the September retail, which was um, actually uh, on the lower side. Okay. Um, so, if you're saying that November and December numbers will look good, uh, on the domestic sales for wholesale, you've done about a little under 1.5 lakh units in the month of October. Uh, what could the run rate be yeah. in November and December? So, maybe I'll not be able to guide you on the forward numbers, but uh, uh, should be similar. Actually, uh, I would expect December retails to be uh, higher as has usually been the trend in the previous years. Okay, so December retails will be higher, got that. Let's talk about exports as well. Export sales were under pressure, down about 4-5% uh, in October. Uh, have you seen any improvement at all in any of the export markets and what is the way forward? So I think uh, we are in line to uh, achieve the numbers, the record exports that we achieved last year, which was about 238,000 or so, uh, and in fact uh, exceeded. Um, of course, you must remember that uh, shipment dates make a lot of difference for these export numbers. So a ship uh, which would be sailing, let's say, on the 2nd of November would be counted in November sales. If it was only two days before, it would have counted in, in, in October. So uh, I think the performance there has been consistent and we expect the consistent performance for the balance year as well. Okay. Uh, within the domestic market, uh, you know, I wanted to check a little bit on how the small car sales were doing, uh, purely because that pocket has struggled a bit as the rural market has not recovered as much as expected. Have you seen normalcy yeah. return there? In the small car market, we did see the improvement both in the quarter two as well as uh, in uh, October. Uh, now, the, that market is roughly around 36% of the overall industry which had fallen down to about 33% prior to September. A lot of it, of course, has to go, do with the, uh, with the introduction of the Alto K10, uh, and that has helped us. And in fact, Alto has become the number one uh, player, a, a model in the industry for the last two months by a far, by a far, far wide margin, uh, 25,000 numbers in uh, September and almost 24,000 uh, numbers in, in, in uh, October. Okay, on that note, we'll slip into a very short break. 